let's go back to the uh, Cook Neon Hotline. And uh, Wade Neely of the X Sports Network joins us. Wade, uh, a new association, uh, but same team and, and same good old Wade. Welcome back in, Wade. Hey, thank you, Dennis. Good to hear from you guys. I'm digging the uh, the scoreboard recaps as if they were just uh, yesterday. <laughs> great. Uh, tell us what happened. I thought uh, I listened to part of the broadcast, and then we broke away because the Coffee County game got er- got over early, and and uh, here you lose it in uh, in uh, in overtime. What happened? Crazy game. Uh, we Giles County. I'll give you as quick as I can. Okay. Uh, Giles County goes up three to nothing. Uh, defensive first half. Uh, second half, they force two fumbles. They score a touchdown on one. Uh, an extra point is blocked. Kind of a miscue there. Uh, so nine to nothing. The ensuing uh, possession, uh, Columbia backed up on a third and long. The first play of the fourth quarter, third and very long, as a matter of fact. They strike on an 80 yards uh, pitch and catch. Great looking pass play. Uh, for some unbeknownst reason, Columbia goes for two, which would have made it nine to eight in the fourth quarter. They do not get it. And Giles County takes over. They take a field goal, go up 12 to 8, or 12 to 6, beg pardon. Uh, and on the ensuing kickoff, Columbia returns one for a touchdown, 12 to 12, your new score. They go to overtime. Uh, Giles County scores very first play of overtime on a Jordan Tucker touchdown. Uh, his second touchdown of the night, he had over 185 rushing yards. Bobcats line up in a swinging gate formation. They elect to go for two, and they do not – Convert the two-point conversion. Columbia scores on their first play. They kick the extra point. Pandemonium ensues, and Columbia stuns Giles County tonight. Wow. Uh, now, I had that game as being in Columbia. Was it at Lindsey Nelson Stadium, or was it at the at the uh, Brick House? It was uh, in Columbia tonight. Uh, okay. They had the Murray County Fair going on in the background. I believe they had a tractor pull, in fact, going on. It was, uh, it was quite loud and raucous tonight, and uh, the home crowd went home happy. Uh, in one of the wilder finishes, I think, I've had the chance of calling in my time here in Giles County. Uh, Wade Neely is with us on WKSR. That has not changed the part of the X Sports Network. Uh, Dennis Weaver, Josh Peterson on the Friday Night Thunder Network. Wade doesn't get any easier for Giles County. Uh, next week, got to go to Shelbyville, a team that uh, put uh, kind of took it to Lawrence County tonight, a team that always has a lot of speed. And uh, Mason Cunningham will be, uh, you know, running around, I'm sure, uh, quite a bit next week. So Giles County has a lot of game planning to do, right? Oh, no doubt. Coach Walt Smith said, you know, normally we wait till Monday to start putting the game plan and working. But after such a difficult loss, uh, the best thing to maybe do is get back to work. And really they can't afford not to because Shelbyville is a, a very, very talented team always. Uh, they've had some great games against Shelbyville the last couple of years. Shelbyville's got them a time or two here and there, including last year. So uh, I'm anticipating a good game. Cats are on the road again next week. That's the bad part. Uh, but the good part is, is uh, they'll have a week to maybe let this tough loss kind of stew, and maybe they can put that emotion uh, in play next Friday night. All right, Wade, we appreciate it as always. Uh, take care and have a safe drive back to Pulaski, okay? I certainly will. Hey, before I go, I want to yep. give a quick shout-out to the uh, folks over in Linville, the Richland Raiders. Uh, big win tonight over Sale Creek. They're 1-0, and and uh, they've got another very winnable game next Friday night. The Raiders could be on the, on the come up here throughout the year. All right, Coach Joe Moose is probably not in range of hearing us just yet, but uh, we would love to hear from him uh, tonight before we go off the air. Wade, thanks a lot, buddy. All right, thanks, guys. All righty.